Mmm. Mmm. Very tasty. That's the best thing I've ever had. That's sweet of you guys. It, it's actually a specialty of mine. An old family recipe I have adapted over... Um. <clears throat> right. Task at hand. Uh -huh. So, what are you guys doing here at the castle? We're looking for a special tree. I... Dad, it's a secret. So, what's so special about this tree? Well, it's magic. If we cut it down, we can sell the wood for way more money than we can spend in a lifetime. I... Why am I telling you all this? Because you just ate more than your share of Truthberry Cobbler. So, I'll be asking the questions, if you don't mind. Thank you. Why don't you guys wear shirts? <laughs> we don't have shirts. <clears throat> so, what makes you think the magic tree is here? It isn't. We know the tree is exactly 30 furlongs from this castle. We just don't know in what direction. <clears throat> We've been searching these woods for years. Found it. We've made a chart of everywhere we've searched. Only this section remains. So this magic tree is in there somewhere. Why did you guys tie up Nana Cloudwig and Hexala? We took them for rival woodcutters. Woodcutters have rivals? <sighs> Storian! <laughs> All our lives, we've cut wood in this forest, and there's nothing to show for it but scars! We could be rich men! All of us! She's not just a tree, Stoyan! My father and I would speak with you, Your Highness. Your Highness, we are sworn to protect the Queen Tree, but as we all seen, the it's apparent the Queen Tree needs no protection. We beg your leave to return to the woods, Highness. To the woods? The trees of the woods have no one to defend them. It's the woodcutter's code to protect the forest for the generations yet to come. Sir Yaska and Sir Emelian, knights of the realm and protectors of the queen. You have fulfilled your office with honor. I give you leave to return to your home and appoint you guardians of the woods. I know the wife for you, son. Dad. Tobar's daughter, Everilda. Oh. Now that girl can swing an axe. I don't want a girl who can swing an axe. She's got the shoulders of a bull. Oh. She'd bear you gargantuan sons. No, no, stop, no! What? She's got hands like a man! What? 